Okay. Oh, I didn't think about that, getting it around the rocks that are in there, just to put it in place. something new for you to host and you're gonna learn real quick coral banded shrimp that that's not something to mess with <laughs> <laughs> Where do you want to put that piece? Over here or over here? Huh. We'll have to figure that out. Oh. What? He's, he's about to take a lesson, or did he get it, I wonder? He was reaching for it. Yeah, maybe he, maybe he figured it out. Cause he backed off. Hey clowns. That's a gift for you guys. Hopefully you'll take to it. That anemone's for you. Hopefully you'll forget you ever had a car. Does it feel soft? No, but the chunk of rock that it's on is like kind of broken. Oh. So it's almost like two pieces, huh. if you know what I mean. Yeah, I kind of do. I mean, it's still together. Right. That's because it's 
Right. <laughs> the coral's holding it together. Right. But the rock is actually two pieces. Right. Gotcha. I get it. It looks good. Hopefully it'll get good light there. I think it will. Yeah. The one thing is that it's not going to contrast a lot with the purple of the rock that it's on. It will. There's a lot of green in it. As soon as the green comes out, it's, it will. Because there's more green in it than, than what you're seeing right now. Yeah. When it opens up, there will be. That's just what it looks like right now because it's mad. It's closed up from being in the bag. Huh? It's closed up from being in the bag, probably from transport. But it'll open up more. Okay. Now we'll let them all relax for a while and then throw in some reefs too. Right. Let every let everyone eat. And that sea star is still inside the car. So those clownfish can forget about ever getting their car back and they can go host the anemone. And they seem like they're kind of thinking about it, but they haven't quite figured out that that's what they're supposed to be doing. It's like instinctively they kind of know it, but they they don't know why they're feeling that way. They're swimming around it. I think they're going to take to it. Well, it's in the, it's in the spot where the stuff they were hosting was mm -hmm. before was. So they're going to frequent that spot. Right, because that's where they always went before. It looks really cool. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. I think I would like that better down on the sand. I know, I kind of do too. But I, it seems like it's going to have more contrast. It's going to stand out more. Mm -hmm. I'm going to stick it down there. Okay. Dang it, I just washed my arms. <laughs> Right next to the goby hole. We'll see what the goby does. He don't go in there very often. He doesn't really go in his holes that much anyway. Any of his holes. Where is he anyway? Hi. <laughs> That's not like him. I mean, I guess it's like a goby, but it's not really like our goby. Pretty. I like it. Yeah, I like that better down there. You can see it better. Agreed. Yep, and that anemone, I like the, the circulation it's getting. Yep. Look at that. Mm-hmm. It looks nice. Uh -huh. The way it's pulsing and stuff. I'm going to close those blinds. They like the sunlight, though. I know. I just want to see it from 